I call these pick your poison circles. So you're gonna relax with your legs bent and your head and neck and shoulders stable. You wanna keep your shoulders, your ribs, and your hips all nicely lined up to the ceiling and then lift your leg. And you're trying to lift your leg without hiking your hip. So you're keeping some nice space in through here. And you're gonna to start to just turn your leg in whatever feels like the appropriate position for you to find your sweet spot. And in this context, your sweet spot is the place where you're feeling this is the most challenging, healthily challenging position for my hip to hold. So if you know that external rotation is not appropriate for you, this is not the position you're going into. For you, it might actually be an internal rotation. Everybody is gonna be a little bit different. So for me, it's here. In that position, make small circles. And again, this is staying nice and still. There's no big shifting of your pelvis back and forth. And you might be here, right? You might be an internal, you might be at neutral. Every single angle is helpful. We're just trying to get your brain to start connecting to the places you don't usually go, assuming that there's no health reason not to do that. Change directions and circle the other way. Check in with your bottom leg, ask your bottom leg to relax. Check in with your waist and make sure that you're not using your, hiking your hip to create your circle and that you're not rocking back and forth. So nice and still. One more circle. Ah, oh, and then bring your leg down. That might have a little bit of sensation connected to it. And then, and this will come as a huge surprise to you, we're gonna do the other leg. So flip yourself around and you're gonna do the same thing. Take a moment, head, neck, shoulders, ribs, pelvis all nicely lined up, which is sometimes a little further forward through the pelvis than we think it might be. Bring your leg up with your knee bent and then just start to turn. And the turn is not coming from your foot or your knee, it's actually coming from your leg in the hip socket. So imagine a, a ribbon maybe around the top of your leg. This is where you're spinning from. Find your sweet spot. Might not be the same as the other side. And again, if you know that external rotation is not appropriate for you for whatever reason, then you're not going far into rotation. And then you start your circles, keeping everything nice and still. The bottom leg might be a little bit more active this side because it's already kind of freshly turned on from the, the previous set. So just ask it to relax and lie on the floor. Change directions. For me, my circles are less high on this side because, because it's not the same from side to side. Last one, and then bring your legs down. 